I can record it here and send you the file if you can sync it up easily. Sure. All right, let's do that. Greetings, folks. Jason McNamara here. I am going to give myself a little bit of a challenge because you all know I'm a bit of an audio nut. I'm standing here at 3D Audio along with Jeff Gold. Hey there. Now, are you the engineer who came up with this? Yes, I came up with it, and this is the first time we're releasing it at the NAMM show. Nice. And uh, we believe this is the only microphone that can capture everything perfectly from 3 hertz to 30,000 hertz anything you can hear, but not only with flat frequency response, it gets the exact 3D placement. So we've set up a challenge where we will blindfold you and either I'll make some noises around you or I'll make them around the microphone and you'll hear them through headphones and I believe you won't be able to distinguish them consistently between the two. And we so How much do you in, believe that? I'll give this $100 bill to anyone that can do it 10 times in a row accurately. That's 10 times in a row, okay. So, and I won't eat for a week. I have to say, I just had a listen to the sound demo over there of them doing a, it was like a, a war recreation type of a thing. The sound is nuts. Like you not only hear the left and the right in ways that you've never heard it, it actually goes behind the back of your head and it's just, it's magnificent. Ah, get down! This way, this way, come on! Reloading! Go, 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 go! Take him down! Too fast! Ah! Contact left! I don't see him! Ah! On me, on me! Go, 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 go! So what I'm going to do is I'm going to either hold these somewhere around your head for yep. real, in which case I want you to hold that sign up real high, Yep. or I will be over there moving them around the microphone, and if I move them around the microphone, I want you to hold that one hold up. That one up. Okay. The idea is it's going to be so difficult to tell the difference, I'll be able to fool you. Sure. So we'll see. Let's give it a go. Yeah, but you got to start over there like you did with everyone else first too, otherwise it's unfair. Do it one more time. Champion, well done. So this is the thing, can you do it now that I can see? Can you just show so they can see and I can hear the reaction? Now, now do it right here where I am. Have you got the ability to take out of there for a second? Let's do this. Because that was amazing, guys. Like, that was absolutely mind-blowing. Jeff, what you're not aware of yet is I'm actually a working sound recordist. Excellent. Right? I live in Tokyo. Sweet. Uh, and I do sound recording, videography, sound editing on a TV show, and I edit video and all this stuff. So to have something that... I knew you were going to try and mess me up by going right next to me first but it was so authentic, I was blown away. So folks, he's recording right now on his laptop and he's gonna send me the file. Have a listen to this. Can we go over there now? <laughs> so, so, we're both talking into this. Yeah, right? I'm We can just continue here. our conversation. And you can hear everything going on at the NAMM Festival right now, three-dimensionally. That's it, the spatial sound. So when I walk around here like this and I simply go on the other side, if you've got headphones on and you listen to this, that would have been traveling through the back of your head. Yeah. And I can take these keys, for example, and just toss them. Most often, they don't mind, for example, and just toss them. Most often, they don't mind, for example, and just toss them. And honestly, I really was fooled. It's insane, this technology. So, hey, can I ask, what are the microphones inside? Uh, we use uh, Earthworks to uh, custom calibrate the microphones for us. Our base model is made with their M30 microphones, which go up flat frequency response from three hertz all the way to 30,000 hertz. We do a, a another model, the Ultra, which is based off of their M50 microphones. It's flat all the way up to 50,000 hertz, and it even can record up to 100,000 hertz. Wow. Now our ears won't hear it even the 30,000 hertz, so you don't really need the Ultra for anything standard musical, but 
I actually took the ultra version inside a cave in New Mexico at Carlsbad Caverns. I recorded bats that had never been recorded there before. Wow. And I used 192,000 uh, sampling rate along with that uh, Barnaby Ultra. I removed everything below 20K that you could hear, so it was silent. I had this silent recording, but then in the program, I transposed it down an octave, still didn't hear anything. I transposed it down another octave, another octave, I suddenly started hearing Say it and again. when I got down four or five octaves, it's this beautiful, we have it on our website, it's this beautiful like chatter of bats that nobody wow. had ever heard that way before. That's insane. So is there a technology that you're doing? Because I noticed you got one cable, but yet there's stereo sounds. So yeah, that's just a, just a five pin to um, cool. stereo XLR just to make it easy. You didn't have two, it out. two cables hanging out. So but what just, is the magic here that people get if they buy your unit? I mean, you know. They, they get the microphone, the stereo microphone. Uh, it's it's, solid it's too. set up with a uh, place you can uh, snap on. Like a portable Tripod. recorder. Yep. We love the um, mix freeze by sound devices. I go out and do field recording. Just a short cable you can carry around, do whatever you want. Comes Crazy. with a windscreen so you can be out in a windy storm or something yep. and record that. I've got a ride coat at home yeah. as well, of course. Yeah. And then I've got an adapter that goes up here for holding an iPhone. Say you want to do like some amateur video. Uh, so to buy to buy this complete, yeah. how much does it cost someone to buy a complete? It, it's five thousand dollars for the Barnaby Pro. And we do the Barnaby Ultra for 7,500, which is for most musical applications, unless someone wants to spend that much, it's really way overkill because you're not going to hear sure. the difference. If you want to go into cave and record bats, so that's what you need. That's incredible, though. There you go, folks. New technology, 3D audio. Check it out.